Max and Black DTNVS is a super popular goggle out on the market. And one thing that's really nice about the DTNVS is it takes PVS 14 style optics. So that means your objective lenses and your ocular lenses are PVS 14 uh, style. So that means what's nice about that is any ocular lens or objective lens that is fits that PVS 14 style thread pitch you can use. So one of the options that we get asked about frequently is the depth ether ocular lenses. And since a lot of people like to go with these because of their benefits, we wanted to show just a quick video on how to properly focus these so you don't damage your goggles. So one thing to note on the depth ether is everything that's going on here. You've got your, your mounting ring, you've got your lock ring, and you've got your adjustment right here. So when these are installed, this ring right here of this eyepiece is what is threaded onto the housing. You'll notice that there's set screws going in to hold this into place. So it's very important that when you're focusing your depth ether ocular, you don't torque on this piece of the eyepiece because that's going to strip out your threads on your housing and cause damage to your goggle. So what we recommend to do when you get your first get your depth ethers is you go into a dark adapted place, get ready to focus, and what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hold the base of the eyepiece right here so you don't provide any accidental tension on it while you're focusing. This ring right here is your lock ring. You're going to, it will come loose and back and go in. And there's an O-ring seal right here. So this lock ring, you want to make sure it's tightened down initially so you've got full motion of your adjustment. Then while you're holding the base of your ocular, you can twist the rear piece of the lens for your focal adjustment. A couple important things to note. Like we said, don't put accidental tension on the base of your eyepiece because that will strip out your threads. And also, when you're adjusting your ocular adjustment, do note that you can twist this completely off. If you twist this completely off, you are going to have to have these professionally purged and collimation checked. Um, and this is just a simple O-ring. This is gonna give you a lot of really fine adjustments with a wide range, so as you get back, you really shouldn't have to go anywhere close to popping it out, but just know that that is a risk. And once you get, so say, that's your focal point, then take your lock ring, back it out, and now it's locked. So now that you've focused your ocular lens, you've locked it in place with your ring, you, unless your prescription of your eye changes, you're not gonna have to adjust this again. And that's how you focus your depth ether ocular lens.